There we go. All right, Tone, let's uh, tell everyone what we're doing here today. We're doing another nest inspection and we're gonna do a nest change on one of the nests that the babies are five days old in. Okay, and this is his T14 coming down. And these are, you said they're five days old? The ones that we're gonna change the nest on are five, yes. Okay, and we've got uh, the new nest. Uh, yeah, the new nest already made. And we got... I just used pine needles and green leaves. Okay. We got Pat helping us here today too. Their, net, their wing feathers are coming out pretty good. Oh yeah, look at that. So how many do we have here? There are six in there. Okay, and, and uh, these are 12 days old. 12 days? Yep. Okay. Wow. Amazing. <laughs> how many? Uh, how many uh, do you expect to fledge out of this house? See if these hatch. There we got that's another sign. Were they supposed to hatch today? I think so. But we're not gonna give up hope yet. That's why I didn't see him feeding. Alright, these are our guys that we're going to change the nest on. Okay. Oh, they're little guys, aren't they? Yeah. Five days old. Oh, let me get out of the... Okay, so now what, uh, why are we doing this nest, in, uh, net, nest replacement? Because of blowfly larva, basically. And every time you pick one up, they uh, tend to poop. <laughs> so just be aware of that. Okay. And this nest only has four. She only laid four eggs, so. That's why I like to have an extra tray so it's nice and quick. Okay. Otherwise, you have to empty it out, put the nestlings in another container, and clean the tray before you come back in. Okay. And here I'm going to dump everything out and see what we can find in here because that's why we're doing the nest change. Some. Hey, what are we looking at? See oh, the I see them. I see them. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna zoom in on them real quick here. I know. There's some mites in here too, but the red ones, the red color is from the blood they sucked out of the babies. Okay, gotcha. And that's essentially what makes them anemic eventually and kills the babies, right? Yep. If if you have a bad blowfly problem, it can kill the babies. Okay. So as a precaution, I'm changing all the nests at five days old because the first four nests I ever had all died at 10 days old. Okay. Gotcha. And that's it. That's it.